Hello, everybody. So today we're going to do something a little bit different. Uh, I've been thinking lately about games that I've wanted to play that I didn't want to devote a whole stream to. Games I either wanted to test out or games that I haven't played in a while that are short. I just wanted to try them out for a bit. And uh, decided to do what I'm calling a let's check it out because I don't really have a better name for it right now. And uh, these uh, videos are going to be short. Probably going to be about a eh, half hour, maybe an hour if it's something that I don't really want to put down. But we're going to test out some stuff. If I come across something that's really good, I might do a stream on it or I might do a YouTube ex uh, exclusive playthrough of it. I'm not sure yet. We'll have to see. But uh, for the first video, I'm choosing Dark Man which is based off a movie that came out in 1990. It was directed by Sam Raimi and starred Liam Neeson. Uh, it's about a dude who is horribly disfigured by a mobster, and he swears revenge. Somehow, through the process of burning and the treatment thereafter, he gains the ability to have enhanced strength. I think he's got like a constant adrenal overload or something like that. And uh, I remember something's going on where his skin, he, he can wear like synthetic masks or something, but they only last like a certain amount of time until they start to melt. And yeah, he lives in a warehouse and he swears revenge on this mobster. And that's literally the only thing I remember about the movie. I did see the movie a long time ago. Uh, apparently it wasn't that bad. I guess it was a box office success. But uh, it had a couple... Uh, sequels that ended up being direct to video and I'm sure they were fantastic they probably weren't most direct to video sequels suck but who knows maybe they were great either way Ocean uh, developed a game that came out I think a year later and we're going to try it out it had a feature in Nintendo Power I remember thinking wow this looked pretty good because Nintendo Power made it look really good, but Nintendo Power did that about a lot of games, and not all those games were really good. <coughs> Battletoads. <coughs> but anyway, we're going to try out Dark Man. Let's see how it is. So let's get started here. I'm going to move a few things around here. I'm not streaming this on Twitch, so I'm messing with a different overlay, which isn't really an overlay. It's more of just the game itself. Here we go. Dark Man. I don't know what to expect here. I have never played this. Um, all I remember in hearing about it is something about tightropes. <clears throat> and something about, I think, maybe you wear the masks of enemies you beat or something like that. I don't know. Let's check out the story. Oh boy, Dr. Peyton Westlake was a brilliant scientist who was working on a new synthetic skin ideal for burn sufferers. Taking old photographs of burn victims, he was able to mold a mask using a computer to recreate their faces. Unfortunately, the skin was photosensitive and could not last over 99 minutes in light. Well, shit. An evil gang led by Durant broke into the lab looking for an important document. They killed Peyton's assistant in attempting to leave no witnesses. They blew up the lab and Peyton with it, but he survived. Horribly burnt, he was given a new surgical technique which made him unable to feel any pain. And apparently his eyes blinked a lot. Unfortunately, the treatment also had side effects. He had violent mood swings and adrenaline flowed through his body unchecked, giving him great strength. Peyton escaped from the hospital and became Darkman. Help Darkman control his rage and gain his revenge. And for God's sakes, get this man some sleep because he looks like he's very tired. Alright. So yeah, there you go. That's what's going on. Pretty much what I said. Alright, let's start this. Story so far. Darkman is trapped inside a deserted warehouse by Durant's men. You must escape the complex and carry out your plan of revenge. Use buttons A and B to balance on tightrope. Why do I have the feeling that balancing on a tightrope in this game is going to suck? Do I need to hit a button or is that it? 
Seriously, what the hell is with Darkman's eyes? Why does he like constantly flashing around with his eyes? Okay, here we go. Uh, let's see, we got a score. I don't know what the bird is in the top left corner. I've done no research as to like the mechanics of this game whatsoever. I'm just diving straight in. Uh, he's got a skin mask spinning in a circle above for some reason. The hearts, I'm guessing, are my life. Okay, I can jump with A. Kick and punch with B. Uh, oh boy. Oh boy. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, Darkman kind of controls like shit, it feels like. Okay. <laughs> wow. Darkman has... I hope that's not a timer up top. Is that a timer? Oh, okay, I guess I had to jump on that wall. I don't know what that bird is up top. What is that? Why is that ticking down? I need a minute to talk about this game, but I'm afraid that's the time. Well, I'm dead. Okay, anyway. If you've ever played Vaxanadu, which I streamed recently, Darkman has this thing going on where he walks fine for like a second, and then he starts doing a mad fucking sprint. In fact, Sanandu, it wasn't as bad because you kind of build up to it, but Darkman takes like two steps and then starts like bolting like he's in the damn Olympics. Okay. Whoa, oh shit. I just screwed that up. Okay. Combat seems easy enough. Oh god. Jumping in this is going to be rough, I can tell already. I like how he's able to ninja guide up that wall. It also feels like you need to like be exact with how you land on platforms. Oh boy. I have to get a running start off that platform, which means I need to like take two steps and then jump. I can't just jump off that platform. Yeah. Oh Jesus Christ. Okay. He ran so damn fast just for me holding over to the right that he ran right off the but what the is he crying? Engaging system BIOS, recreation system version 1, enter password, dark man password accepted, hint high scores. Boy, dark man's gonna get hacked if that's his password. Mark Superb, Chris Kicken, Steve Awful, John Chronic. What the f. <laughs> Who. Who put these names in here? John Chronic. This, that's as 90s as you can get. Chris Kicken. Oh, man. Okay, this has a continue system. That's good. Alright, I didn't get very far. Okay, so... I'm gonna need some practice here. Hold on. Uh, okay. Ooh, I almost fell off the tightrope. I have a feeling there's gonna be tightropes later where I cannot fall. But in all honesty, the tightrope thing doesn't feel that bad. It's this crap, like... I can tell I've been in this level for like less than a minute and I've already got some insane platforming going on and Darkman does not control like somebody that needs to be doing insane platforming. His jumping, like I want you to see this again. He takes like two steps and then he like mad dashes like he's Usain Bolt or something. Jesus Christ jumping. And if you don't get that running start, there's no forward momentum whatsoever. But when you do get that running start, he launches himself. There's no... There's almost no in-between with the jumping. Okay. Oops. See, I overshot the platform there. Oh, boy. Okay. I can get past this part. I'm gonna get past this part. I mean, I'm surely not gonna knock it past first level. Okay, okay, we're good. We're good. All right, come here, dude. Whoa! What the? What the hell? Uh. Okay, combat's weirdness. 
like, the way combat seems to work is sometimes you hit the dude and sometimes you don't because I was punching and kicking him and nothing was happening. It's like the guy just got priority over me. That was very, very weird. Am I missing something with combat? Because there's no real range. Like, you can tell you have to be, like, real close to the dude to do anything to him. Shit. Dude! It's knocking me off the platforms because there's pushback. I'm not sure why... Sometimes he hits you, and sometimes you hit him. Like, there's no... There's no real sense that I'm... I guess you just have to kind of get into your rhythm and keep with it. Is that like an item? What? <laughs> uh... Okay. I gotta avoid that piston, apparently. I can do that, surely. I'm gonna get past this. This is a very hard first level, I'll say that. I mean, granted, it's an NES game I've never played before, so that's never gonna end well, but... <laughs> Jesus, okay. Piston's right there. Can I run under it? Okay, apparently that's what I need to do. Is that it? Okay. Assess. Another level. I'm actually gonna save state it. Uh, I can't move on the platform. What the what the hell was that? Okay, I guess I need to follow the arrows, but I was trying to hit the arrows and it wasn't responding. Maybe I need to do it quicker. Man, yeah, you gotta do this quick. I'm actually, I think, just gonna continue from the first area. Oh, okay, that's right, there's continues in this. Well, shit, Dark Man. Dark Man! <laughs> Oh man, you gotta go- oh shit. Man, you gotta go fast on that. Okay. I mean, I imagine once you do that enough, that section's probably not that bad. Am I still on this first stage? Okay. What the hell just happened? Why did I go through the wall? Very, very odd. I don't understand why I went through the wall. Do I need to avoid the actual round thing? Apparently. Okay, here we go already. Yeah, can't fall off this tightrope. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Tightrope walking really isn't that bad. Oh god. <laughs> this game is not built for platforming. Jesus. Okay, at least I landed on that pipe. Okay, climb the wall. Beat that guy up. Fire. Okay, I'm assuming I don't want to land on the fire. Okay. Dark Man has failed in his attempt for revenge, and boy is he upset about it. <laughs> that tear. Wow, that tear. You have to sit through this, uh... Well done, you have entered a high score. Enter name Kevin. Wait, what? I have entered the high score. My name's not Kevin, why is it? Putting Kevin up there. If I entered a high school. K. 
can I continue? Oh, there's limited continues in this. Oh, shit. Okay. Well, that definitely means I'm going to be doing some save stating. Until I get the hang of this. Alright, so initial thoughts is uh, Dark Man needs this stick that feats his strength and not do anything involving agility because holy shit. <laughs> God darn piston, I forgot about piston. I still don't have any idea what the deal is with that bird in the top left corner. I don't know if that's a time limit. Balance thing really isn't that bad. You're just hitting A and B to keep it on B on one side, A on the other to keep it like from going off the grid. That's not too too bad. Okay, I got that pipe, sir. I'll give Darkman this much, he doesn't slide. A lot of NES games around this time, when you land after a jump and you're moving forward, you'll slide. Alright, where's this fire at? There it is. Okay, a oh, piston. Shit. Alright, made it. Alright, that wasn't too, too bad. Staring at your only picture of Durant's, hen Durant's henchman, Polly, you grab your camera. The more photos of Polly taken, the more time you will have to gain your revenge. Okay. Polly. Of course, the mobster has a henchman named Polly. Target Polly. What the hell is this? Okay. Whoa, I'm being shot at. What the hell? Am I supposed to ignore the fact I'm being shot at? Uh, being shot at is generally a problem. You know what, maybe the camera- okay, maybe the camera's not supposed to get shot? That's stupid. I think that's exactly what it is, I can't get the camera lens shot. I like how I'm just casually taking pictures while dudes with machine guns are shooting the shit out of me. What is... This is odd. You're not Polly, are you? Darkman discovers he has taken two close-ups and three long shots, giving him a max, which is good. Of course, his eyes are moving around some more. So, hold up, let me save it. Uh, you track Polly down to Central Park. Putting on his mask, you look around. It feels like a trap, but you don't care. It's because he's freaking Dark Man. Uh, 
Oh. Oh, hey, I got like a club now. I think I just got hit by something. Whoa, shoot, we got guns. I'll just club this dude to death. Can I climb that? Oh, okay, yeah, I can't climb that. Oh, shit. Well, shit. Alright, let's try this again. Random saw moving through the tree. Okay, so I got a guy over there. What is with the giant fish? <laughs> is this something that you... Oh, Christ. <laughs> Why is there a giant fish? What does a giant fish have to do with anything in this world? Is this like a problem <laughs> that everyday people have to deal with? There's giant fish. I thought this was, a, was about a dude who got burned by a mobster and was seeking revenge. Where did giant fish come to play? Oh boy, okay. I'm gonna actually save it here just so I'm not constantly redoing this. Because I had a feeling I was gonna miss that jump, but I didn't. Let's reload. Much better. Okay, um, do I want to deal with the fish or do I want to deal with whatever that guy is up top here? Deal with the fact that I can't seem to jump to save my life. Oh, apparently I one shot at that dude as he came out of the trees. That's neat. That bomb looks like a damn it shatters like an egg. Okay, to note to self, the fish are instant death. As they should be, if they're gonna... If, if I'm running around in a world with seemingly normal people and there's a fish that looks like that, it better kill me. This isn't Super Mario, this is... Something else entirely. Okay, we did it. Is that it? My mask healed up, it looked like. Oh, there's more to this level. This... Oh, shit. This guy does not look like he's built for, uh... This fat guy I'm pretending to be does not look like he is built for this vertical climbing. Damn it, that was dumb. I also just realized that I don't have my, uh... mask meter. So am I not on a time limit here? Actually, that number 34 is ticking down. I don't know what that's all about. What the? Okay. You know what? I'm going to use continue here. It'll give me all my lives back. I'll have to keep reloading. Uh, come on, Dark Man. I get it. The high scores. Enter names. Oh, okay. Oh, I see. I hit return before. That's why they had me as Kevin. Yeah, okay. Yeah, so this is a uh, game. The controls are really wonky. That running in a jumping thing is going to take some getting used to. I mean, it's not horrible. I 
I see it being really hard. Ah, oh, god damn it. So I need to like run up there as quick as humanly possible to avoid the mutated fish. Cause that dude like immediately knocks you off the damn ladder. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do. I can't kill this fish. Okay, that worked. Save it since I made a slight bit of progress here. I'm playing this like a coward, but I want to actually make some progress in this. So I don't see myself streaming this. I really don't even see myself doing a let's play of it on YouTube. It's so weird to be playing as this dude who looks like a really mad middle aged dad who's like, dude. Ooh, 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 that was close. Who's doing Ninja Gaiden wall jumps? Alright, I need to get around that. Saw blade, where are my feet? Like, this is a really weird... I don't, I don't know why... Wait, did I pass that level? I passed that level even though I didn't get up to the highest point. I think I was supposed to get up to the highest point. I think that bugged out. Yeah, this is a very weird game. Like, it's not very grounded in reality. And you would think it would be. I, I can't get over the fact that there's giant mutant fish. That was stupid. That was stupid. Man. Oh, shoot. That was dumb. I thought maybe I could go to the ground from there and get that potion. This guy to turn around, sock him in the back. Wait for this guy, sock him. Fall gently to the ground and get this potion. Like this guy seriously looks like he's gonna go home and tell people to get off his lawn. I said middle-aged dad, he looks more like a grandfather. He's got his, like, sweater that for some reason is pink. Ooh, I didn't think I was gonna make it. Whoa, it's... Oh my god. I'm dead. <laughs> I'm fighting myself. Okay, I guess that's the real Polly then. Alright. So that must be the boss then, the level? That makes sense to me. Ass. Not knocking me off this platform. Urgh. Let's bum rush him. Alright, wait till this guy turns around. Clobber him in the back. Same deal. Slip down here, get the potion. Oh shit. I'm not gonna have much life when I get back here. Oh, I went a different way. Whoa, okay. That threw me off a bit. Polly here, I'm assuming Darkman does this too. I don't think I ducked with Darkman. Polly has like two frames of animation for when he ducks, and it makes ducking and getting back up again really slow. Alright, over here. 
stop punching me, god darn it, I gotta go see my wife. I'm gonna sit around and read all day. Read the paper. And get the hell off my lawn. Wow. Okay, that dude ain't messing around. <laughs> dude is not messing around at all. Wait, this guy turns around. Don't want to take a lot of hits if I can avoid it. I thought those potions were actually healing me. They're not. They're doing whatever that bird thing has going on. Get the hell off! Oh my god, dude. <laughs> that dude is vicious. Alright, we're gonna do some ninja here. Tried to. Failed miserably at it. Just gonna clock him from behind. Jesus Christ. <laughs> <sighs> I'm getting past this level before I stop. I might be intrigued enough to try it a little bit longer. This isn't... This isn't a great game or anything like that, but it's... I don't know. I'm intrigued enough to keep playing. I just... Combat is horrible in this game. That's the big problem with it right now. Like, I've actually gotten used to the platforming, I think, a good bit. Shit. I'm gonna die and can take, like, two hits. Yeah, platforming I'm getting used to, but the actual combat is another thing. Like, all you can really do is swing your club at that guy. And it's not even a matter of swing it fast, it's... Hang on. Let me get another shot at this. There's, I don't know what I'm trying to do with the combat. It seems like once you get a hit in, hit as hard as you can. Or as fast as you can, rather. Jesus Christ. Load it again. Alright, I'm getting past this level. I'm gonna beat Polly. Alright, jump over here. I've already lost a lot of my life. Again. She should want to give me some trouble. Okay. Jump over to saw blade. Actually, this guy gives me trouble too, I think, sometimes. Try to ninja this dude again. I can't. <laughs> Just Christ. I can't even get a shot on that guy. Alright. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay. Ooh, saw blade. actually worked that time. Oh god, I, all right, hold up, I'm saving it. I didn't think I was gonna make that jump. All right, Grandpa, let's do this. Okay, just barely. So yeah, it's like when you hit them, you have to just immediately start jamming on the button. <clears throat> Excuse me. Durant in a helicopter swoops down at you firing his grenade launcher. Avoiding the explosions, you grab a hanging rope for the ride of your life. Oh, wow, this is like a different mode. Okay. I'm guessing I need to avoid all this stuff. Oh, okay. Okay, I need 
need to avoid the bombs. How do I get the coins that are on the truck? <coughs> Excuse me. Okay. You can hit a button and he'll try to grab. Oh my god, so birds I have to look out for, bombs, traffic. Oh, I hope this doesn't go on for long. This is kind of a pain in the ass. The birds don't hurt you for much. Oh, come on. Not birds are getting smarter coming at me at different levels. Bombs don't seem to hurt unless they actually blow up on you. I think I did it. Okay. Darkman has survived the helicopter ride. He now turns his attention to Durant's one-legged henchman, Skip. Ah, that's funny. Darkman picks up his camera. How am I going to play as a one-legged henchman? Okay, I'm looking for a guy in glasses with a blue shirt. I love how I'm alright unless my camera gets shot. Where the hell is this guy at? I don't see him. Dude. Where's this guy at? This guy hasn't popped up yet. Am I supposed to be taking pictures of the dudes who aren't shooting at me? Is that it? Because the dude has not shown up yet. The dude never showed up. One close up and two long shots, giving him a mask with. But the guy they showed me never showed up in the window. Uh. Darkman follows Skip to a carnival. Skip looks about and enters the funhouse. Mask in hand, Darkman follows. I'm gonna save it. If my mask is poor, then I'm gonna get killed quicker. Won't I? Oh my god, he's jumping on one leg. Are you kidding me? Oh, he's got a gun though. Oh my god, yeah, I have barely any life. Oh, what the hell? What the hell was that? Oh, but now I've got full life. I can't believe this guy is hopping on one leg. What the shit? Uh... I, I'm not sure why... The springboard is knocking me the other way. What am I supposed to do here? I also don't understand how I went through all that to make a mask. And it's good or poor or whatever, but when I lose a life, I end up just getting a great mask anyway because my life's filled. What? is the deal with these with these springboards i don't get it like i'm not sure what i'm supposed to be doing with these springboards here okay whoa what in the hell oh god what why did i fall through the floor that had to be a floor, there was a clown standing on it. Uh... Okay... I think... I think the way those springs are working... The one on the right, if I land on that, it, instead of bouncing me straight up in the air like pretty much every other game I've ever played in my life... It throws you back to the right. I have to land on the one to the left, because then it throws me to the left. Okay, that one on the right that time. I can't shoot in the air. 
This is... This is rough. <laughs> what the shit? These springboards seem like they're completely random. I don't get it. Okay, oh, Jesus. Why did I just... I... Okay, I have no idea why he fell off that ball. I wasn't even touching a button on the controller. He just, like, suddenly died at random. I said I had something... Why? Okay, wait a minute. I think I know what's going on with the springboards. I think if I'm pushing over to the left, he goes... Or I'm pushing over to the right. He goes flying to the right. Like, normally you would go... If I feel like I'm going to overshot it, you would push right in midair to kind of make yourself land on the uh, springboard. I can't, <laughs> I can't get over this dude jumping on his one leg. Um, if you try to reposition yourself in midair and you land facing this way on a springboard, it shoots you in this direction. So, <clears throat> I have to land on these springboards facing the left and then I think everything will be alright. Okay. I was right. Apparently, shooting these guys with what looks like a bazooka does not kill them in one shot. Whoa, what the? Okay, I think that was a conveyor belt. Jesus Christ. Oh, shooting that, oh. Okay, there's a balance meter to this, I didn't realize that. <clears throat> shooting this gun shoots me back, I just realized that too. Okay, I don't know why I'm flying through the platform there, though. I'm, f I've, I'm figuring out all of these weird things that are happening, and I can't figure out why I'm flying through, through the floor there. Why am I falling through this floor? Oh, shit. I don't even know why I'm dying, because my neither of my meters were at zero when I got hit there. I am so confused by this level. Oh shit, I faced the wrong way. Okay, that was me. That was me. I'm gonna save it with full life here. falling through this platform. Maybe I was hitting the balloon, because that's the same deal that was going on before. Alright, I'm alright. Oh my god! What's <laughs> Oh, this game. Okay, this level's a bit much. I... I really don't even understand what this has to do with Dark Man. <laughs> like, I know I watched the first Dark Man movie and I don't remember any of this shit. What is going on with that platform? I thought that platform was a conveyor belt, but I stopped on it. Okay, something else is really funny. I gotta, wait a minute, I gotta reload it. Okay, the one-legged guy skips it. He's, he can duck in one animation. The two-legged guy that I was playing earlier had like two frames of animation to duck. This one-legged guy here gets down like it's nothing on his one leg. Zuka throws me back. Okay. Hmm. 
Okay, I think what's going on there is bowling balls are apparently instant death. Which makes a lot of sense if you think about it, I'm on one leg. A bowling ball would probably completely ruin the day of a one-legged man. Like, that actually makes a little bit of sense. It doesn't make for a very good gameplay mechanic that this one attack randomly one-shots you, but... Okay, I'm hitting left and I'm going right. I don't understand this floor at all. Okay, can't jump on the balloons. This game's throwing me off with some shit. Like, okay, I'm gonna jump on this balloon. That balloon, me jumping on that balloon killed me. If there had been a floor under me, it would have killed me. It's a balloon, why is that killing me? Why would jumping on a balloon kill me? Shit. Ah, stupid. Jumping on a balloon shouldn't kill you, you should bounce off of it. This doesn't follow the rules of pretty much every video game I've ever played in my life. Shit. Okay. I'm gonna try this a couple more times, and then I'm probably... God damn, I hit that balloon. Nah, I'm probably calling this one quits. I'm not terribly impressed with this. <laughs> I've played worse games, but... This just has some really weird design, especially this level. This level has a lot of stuff that you... I don't know. Jesus, I can't get over jumping on a balloon kills you. And it's not even... you can't even be like, okay, well he's a one-legged man. Like, you can't with the bowling ball, like... Oh, shit. I didn't keep balance. It gave me, like, a second. Oh, God, okay. Alright. I'm alright. If that bowling ball came down on my head and killed me, I would have been like, what the hell? Jesus H. Christ, I can't get past that part. Well, I overshot the springboards that time with my crazy ass running. Jesus. Alright, here's my rule. Five more times. That's all I'm giving this. Five more times. I've been on this for 48 minutes. So. I have no idea what killed me right there. There was nothing hitting me. Didn't look like the clown made contact with me. Ah, oh, it's... <laughs> Patience. Alright, you know what? Screw you, clown. This one-legged man is on a damn ball on a tightrope. And I don't think he's supposed to be a clown character. I think he just is apparently that balanced. Him. I still have no idea what those potions are supposed to do. Whoa, shit! Ah. Oh. Yeah, I'm calling it quits. Okay, so Dark Man. That was a game. Uh. I can't say I'm ever gonna play that again. Maybe one day, ten years from now, when I'm looking for something random to play, I'll pop it on and be like, hmm, Dark Man, I don't remember this one. Yeah, not terribly impressive, you know, impressed with Dark Man there. So, there we go. My first, uh, let's check this out, or whatever the hell I'm calling it. Maybe I'll come up with a better name in the morning and be going to sleep here. So, yeah, check back next time. Hopefully we play something that's a little bit better than that. Take care.